Mega Park. AI and AI skaters are blind as fuck. The fact that jumping the shark is actually a thing. Okay, so you're practically the fastest thing on Earth, but you're not allowed to go five seconds in the air without respawning? What the hell? So there's this easily accessible passageway you can go through in the core that everyone knows about. It's practically Narnia. But why is it that the environment around here, once you get past that tunnel, the graphics look like shit? Just look at it. Walk through fences. Coffin Master. I get it. The names on these walls, they're just people who made these games or whatever, help them. But it's just repeated constantly. It's everywhere. It's even on this plaque. Why? The render distance in this game is just terrible. They just spawn right in front of you. Like, you need to see these cars. It's the rule of life. You look both ways. You don't get hit by a car, but in this game, You'll get hit by a car no matter what. The render distance on objects are just terrible as well. You can clearly see when it goes blurry to clear. Also, why are the only two real sponsors are Miracle Whip and Dr. Pepper? Everything else is just fake. Also, blind as fuck drivers. Intangible stop signs. Coach Frank. So Coach Frank is supposed to coach you on how to skate, but you're like the fastest thing on earth. Why the hell can you not knock him down? Bots are practically programmed. So then why the hell do they shake and jitter when going straight? Ah, who programmed me? Shut up. This gesture. Probably one of the most things I really hate is when the host just does not start the game because they're AFK. There should be some sort of time limit. So if you're AFK long enough, you'll get ejected from the game and you'll get a new host. I don't know why that's not here. I have heard EA has fucked up many developers in the past and then they are just forced to just rush their game. That's what I'm concluding at Art Gallery. Art gallery is something that was just rushed, as you can clearly see, there are just places where it looks like there should be billboards and whatnot, and it's just an unfinished place. Also, did anyone know this was here? When in regular, you are practically a magnet to your board. Just another reason why art gallery is broken. There are random places in the world that will light your character green or blue. It's just completely random, and it just happens. For a tough guy that can drop from space and survive, why can't you stand in ankle deep water? AI Sensory Directions At the Black Box Skate Park, there are two random benches. That are on this level. And I don't know why they're here. Because the only reason to get up here. Is you have to speed glitch. That's the only way I found out a way to get up there. Meaning that a normal player doesn't know how to glitch. Won't be able to skate these benches. Which is completely flawed. This rooftop. Object spawning. Character physics. Yes, I know this game is made in 2010, so it's six years old, but there is no excuse for trees to be this linear. I mean, if you even go up close to trees that are actually within bounds, if you go up close, you can actually see that they are thin as fuck. Random floating objects underneath maps. Because why not put a random bush and a random roadblock underneath a map? Mongo pushing. Flat as fuck bleachers, because fuck you. Another place you can't get to without speed glitching. Cop sirens and fire trucks, even though you cannot see them. This mysterious black blob formation. Potholes. They say they're keyframes, but it's more than one frame till you can place the other keyframe. So that's not really a keyframe, EA. The sky is blue as fuck! Reflections. The only way to tell what's out of bounds is by looking at the shade of the color. 
so focused on making a skate world that you forget to include these seam lines where you can see right through the world. This shirt has a hole in it. The whole idea of the object dropper is to create your own skate spot. So why place all of them down and make the world lag like hell? Really makes no sense. Your foot goes through the board when doing dark catches. The Illuminati. Why the hell not taking one off because of unicorns? When calling your board back, it shouldn't go through your body. All the rails in the game you are able to grind on, but besides this rail, you are not allowed to do board slides. It'll just fuck you over. Green shadows. Yes, I know I went out of bounds, but why put this here? No one's gonna see it and no one's gonna wanna see it. Why the hell does it have to stick out? Magical vending machine. Yes, because all lawn grows in a polygonal shape with sharp edges. I don't even know how to explain this one. This was a pipe that was obviously cut in half so you could skate through it. So when you look through it, it should just be darkness, meaning that the pipe just leads on. But no, there is fucking concrete right there. That shouldn't be there. So if you open up your object dropper in industrial, you're able to select the container one and two. But anywhere else that is downtown or university, you are unable to select the container and you cannot place it down. Why? Because fuck you. All small objects and even AI shoes look unrendered as fuck. No, that is not a five-year-old's interpretation of a snowflake. That is indeed the Skate 3 Moon. Now I got a little surprise for you.